To succeed with DevOps, you need to have the right culture in place. And this is a challenge for most organizations because historically, there's always been friction between development and operations. Development is focused on delivering new capabilities quickly, while IT operations, they're concerned with maintaining stability and control. So how do organizations end this deadlock with a strong DevOps culture based on open communication and transparency? Let's start by exploring the characteristics of a DevOps culture. The first is open communication. Rather than working in silos, DevOps teams work collaboratively to drive improvements across the product's lifecycle, from idea inception to full production. In a strong DevOps culture, everyone openly communicates and shares information. Of course, with better communication comes respect. With DevOps, contributions from everyone should be recognized and valued. This means creating an environment where no one is afraid to speak up for fear of being rebuked or upsetting someone. The second critical element of a strong DevOps culture is trust. IT operations must trust that what development is working on is right for the business. Development has to trust how performance feedback from operations can improve their code. And both teams must trust QA to remove constraints and provide unpolluted test data. The third critical element of a DevOps culture is alignment. In my experience, one of the best ways to foster alignment is by establishing shared goals. For example, rather than rewarding developers for producing more lines of code or rewarding operations for fixing production problems, it is important to establish shared goals that foster collaboration. This might be quickly delivering new revenue-producing applications or increasing the quality of existing customer-facing services. Whatever it is, everyone is focused on shared goals and business outcomes. Here are some practical steps you can take to create a strong culture that supports the DevOps approach. Gain executive sponsorship to get everyone on the same page. This involves articulating DevOps value in clear business language, especially how IT goals align to business goals. Assess the current cultural landscape working across the software factory to determine why people work in certain ways, especially where constraints lead to poor practices. Demonstrate why you are changing. Start by showing how the benefits exceed the costs and put into place the right types of metrics. For example, faster software rollouts, increased customer conversions, and defects detected before production. Try to avoid setting up a separate DevOps team that could become yet another silo. If you do go down that path, use it only as a temporary function with leaders that are skilled in impressing the value of changing tools, processes, and behaviors, and making it stick. When possible, consider co-locating the teams. When folks share the same workspace, they quickly build empathy, understanding how their practices impact the work of others. Start small, but think big. Select a project where a strong collaborative DevOps culture can yield rapid benefits, yet isn't too small to be placed in the too easy basket by skeptics. Changing culture and people behaviors is never easy. But by bringing IT teams and their unique sets of skills together for the collective benefit of the business, great things can and will happen.